What is up, you guys? It's your girl, Kat, and I missed What a Sign Wednesday yesterday, so I'm going to do it right now. Okay, so we're going to start with Scorpio, um, and then I will do the um, fire signs. All right, but first we're going to do the water signs. Scorpio, what is up? Oh, i, I got to move my cup here. This is my favorite mug in the whole wide world. You guys don't laugh at me. It's Charlie Brown, the Great Pumpkin. Isn't it cool? I love this mug. It's got a big old chip in it. This is the best. You can't tell me nothing. Okay, we're good. We're good. Um, let me put this over here. Okay, sorry. <laughs> Back to your reading. Okay. <laughs> all right so we'll lay them all out and then we'll read them look it up I do not remember but I think wasn't it last week that I said somebody from your past is coming back and they want to help you wasn't that wasn't that Scorpio I think it was I don't remember but anyway <laughs> that's what I'm getting again um it looks like your money is going to be very good here look at this this is all stability security look at this I feel like you're going to get like a promotion or a raise. Something's going to happen with your financial situation. It's going to get a lot better where um, you're not going to have to work as hard and you're going to have more money. Um, you're going to be more comfortable. This looks very secure so far is what I'm getting. Excuse me. <laughs> and then... Um, so the justice is in a position where you're treated fairly. You could even be in a position where you're, um, I don't want to say ruling over others, but um, where you're in a position of authority over others, like a manager, supervisor, something of that nature. But I feel like emotionally, right? Because cups are our emotions. Somebody's trying to hand this guy the cup and he's like, I don't know if I want the cup. I feel like that's where a lot of you are, Scorpio, right now. You're just kind of, you're working really hard. You're getting your money straight. You're like, you know, putting away for a rainy day. Like, that's looking really good. But when you stop and take a breath, it's like, oh, that might be nice to be in a relationship again. I know, some of you. Um... Things ain't what aren't what they appear. Hmm. Could be deceiving yourself. Yeah, I think you're deceiving yourself. I think that you're trying to tell yourself that you're balanced all on your own, that you don't want a relationship, that you're good, you don't need it, you don't want it. You know, of course you don't need it. You know, having somebody in your life is a choice. It's not a necessity. Um, <coughs> and here is the cycle coming back around. Which makes me think it might be somebody from the past. I'm not getting that 100% here, but that could be an indicator. Let's see what we got. Okay, but your money looks really good. I think like things on the job are going to be fantastic. But I think you might be feeling a little lonely and just, you know, trying to pretend you're not lying to yourself a little bit. No, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good on my own. All right, let's pull a couple more. Oh, some kind of conflict happening. <clears throat> hmm. 
sniff it. Could have something to do with uh, marriage or I don't know. Some of you aren't sure how you feel about something. <clears throat> Listening to your intuition. Could be keeping secrets too. You're hiding something. Hmm. This is very strange. Okay. Let's clarify some of this. I feel like this is a long reading, right? This is a I'm so blind, you guys. We're already at five minutes. Who cares, right? Scorpios. Okay, so remember I said the money, right? Yeah. There's the nine of cups. This is something that's going to make you feel really good. It's going to help you feel satisfied. You're going to be in a good spot. And then we had the ten of cups, pentacles, which is like security, stability. Your home life is very stable and secure, okay? Uh, something to do with communication. We'll see what happens with that. And then remember, I said you're going to be very stable, looking really good. Communication from somebody from your past. Remember, I said somebody from your past could come back around and offer to help you out. I think that was in your last reading. It looks like it might happen. Okay, and then we have this big old pentacle here, the Ace of Pentacles. What's up with that? Yep. They, got, they want to be in a relationship with you again. Some of you, they want to be committed to you. All right. And then I said that you would be in a position where you would possibly be over other people, like a managerial position. That's being patient and waiting. So I think that you've been doing something at work where you're just kind of biding your time and waiting for the next thing. Well, it looks like it's coming, you know. Um, but emotionally, you're a little like, eh. Oh. You want to be happy. You're good, but you want to be happy, you know. And I interpreted this as maybe like lying to yourself a little bit, saying, eh, I'm good on my own. I don't need anybody. Yeah, you're tired of carrying everything by yourself. You know, this guy's tired. He's walking up the hill with this big old pile of sticks here. Got nobody to help him. Got nobody to talk to. He's lonely, you know? He needs a partner. I shouldn't say needs. Wants a partner. Okay. These things are more balanced, right? Hmm. Not admitting some feelings about something. Okay, and then I said the coming back around, right? Yep, that's somebody who's going to put in some effort, help even things out. Told you. Okay, and then I, we pulled conflict. What's up with conflict? Why is that here? It's somebody you ended something with. and Yeah, somebody you ended something with, and I feel like you had a big falling out with them. They're coming back around. And they want to be with you again, and they want to help you out. And it could be because you're doing so well. You're going to be doing really well. Like, you're going to get a promotion or a raise. You're going to be making some dollars. And then they're going to show up, right? Okay. And then some of them, they may even ask you to marry them. <laughs> what I just pulled. Yeah, some of you are getting getting a, an engagement ring. But you're not sure how you feel about this now. Hmm. Working towards something. Maybe you feel like you're working towards that. You're not there just yet, like marriage and all of that. listening to your intuition and I feel like you're keeping something to yourself and I do feel like these go together I feel like maybe you have like some inner hunch and you're not sharing it right hmm. 
something about this connection you don't feel good about and you're not expressing it. Hmm. Very interesting. All right. I think that we should pull the Lover's Oracle. Okay. I got to remember I got that candle going over there. I'm going to go up in flames. <laughs> All right. Let's try to shuffle these heart-shaped cards. Great idea. <laughs> All right. I'm just going to pull from the middle. If I can. All right. Let me, um, oh no, where I put my glasses? I always do this, you guys, all the time. Okay. Got it. Hi. <laughs> Sorry. I can't see anything about these. Okay, especially because it's dark in here. Yeah, you know, I can't see. I mean, that get cute, right? <laughs> Just kidding. Okay. Secret admirer. Ooh. Someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. Boom, chicka, wow, wow, Scorpio. Look at that. Pretty cool. All right. So that's what I have for you guys for this week. I hope you like that. If you have not yet subscribed to the channel, Come on, say it with me. Hit that button. Join the Scorpio Cat family. The more the merrier, right? Come on. We are almost at a thousand subscribers, you guys. I can't even believe that. You guys are the best. The best. All right. If you want to be notified when I upload a video, there's a bell shape. You hit that. You get a notification. I think that's it. All right. So until next time, bye Scorpio. Take care.